Hello everyone, my name is Julie K. The Bible says, go ye into the world and multiply. Nigerian factor is not really making it very easy for people to get married and to stay married. Now, to God be the glory, I'm happily married. Okay? But ladies and gentlemen, please, it is not a must that everybody must get married. Yes, at times if I talk like this, people will feel that, okay, he's married, that is why he doesn't want us or he doesn't wish us marriage. But let me tell you, over time, do you know how many cases of divorce I have heard of? So many men are looking for one or two excuses to leave their partners as well as the ladies and so many people are just out there they are praying that they just want to get married marriage marriage that is their ultimate goal there's a whole lot you need to know about marriage a whole lot it's an institution that you don't graduate from <laughs> and besides it said that it's for better for worse okay apart from domestic you know, violence and all that. There's a whole lot of things that you need to endure. Are you really ready? Just yesterday, somebody had his naming of his child. And to my greatest surprise, the little money that was given to this child became an issue between the couple. Do you know that as we speak, they are separated? I know of another person that has run, a man, he has run and left his wife. Because he doesn't have money to pay school fees, to get to put food on the table. And he feels the best way is for him is to run away and to leave her with that burden, his own responsibility, which you've taken an oath before God and before other persons on earth that you are going to provide for your family. You don't run leave them. And somebody is seated outside saying, I need a man, I need a man, I want to get married. That is not your ultimate good. Everybody must not get married. Yes, the good times are there, but are you ready to stay when the bad time comes? When it comes, for real, will you be there? Will, will you stand the test of time? I'm not trying to scare you not to get married. But please, there's a whole lot of things you need to put into cognizance before you start thinking of venturing into this institution i'm not happy about this that's why i'm talking about it but ladies especially because of this marriage thing the i don't know the way this thing they do in my head when i want where i should be when i want to do makeup when i want to do when i want to post the way other people they do guy it doesn't end here it doesn't end here i'm not scaring you but just be sure you are ready for this and prepare more for the worst not the good times.